Eastern Fox Squirrel The Eastern Fox Squirrel is a species of tree squirrel native to Eastern North America. These squirrels are one of the largest squirrel species in North America and are known for their distinctive appearance and behavior. Here are some key characteristics and information about Eastern Fox Squirrels. Number 1. Appearance. Eastern Fox Squirrels are typically larger than other squirrel species, with adults ranging from 17 to 27 inches, 43 to 68 centimeters, in length, including their tail. Their fur is variable in color, but they often have a mix of gray, brown, and orange hues. The underside of their bodies is usually lighter in color. Number 2. Tail. They have a long, bushy tail that helps with balance and serves as a signaling device. Their tail can measure up to 13 inches, 33 centimeters, in length. Number 3. Habitat. Eastern fox squirrels are adaptable and can be found in a wide range of habitats, including forests, urban areas, parks, and suburban neighborhoods. They are known for their ability to thrive in human altered landscapes. Number 4. Diet. These squirrels are omnivorous and have a varied diet. They feed on a range of foods, including nuts, seeds, fruits, insects, bird eggs, and even small vertebrates. They are known to cache, bury, food for later consumption. Number 5. Behavior. Eastern fox squirrels are diurnal, which means they are active during the day. They are agile climbers and can often be seen running up and down trees. They are also known for their bounding gait when traveling on the ground. Number 6. Reproduction. Breeding typically occurs in late winter and early spring. Female eastern fox squirrels give birth to litters of two to four offspring, known as kits, after a gestation period of about 44 days. The mother cares for and nurses the young until they are old enough to venture out on their own. Number 7. Urban Adaptation. These squirrels are often seen in urban and suburban areas, where they may become accustomed to human presence and even seek out food from bird feeders and garbage cans. However, feeding wild animals, including squirrels, is generally discouraged as it can disrupt their natural behaviors and diet. Number 8. Conservation Status. Eastern fox squirrels are not considered globally threatened or endangered. They are relatively common in their range and are adaptable to various environments. However, like all wildlife, they can face threats from habitat loss and fragmentation. Eastern fox squirrels, like all wildlife, face various biological challenges in their natural habitats. These challenges can influence their survival, behavior, and population dynamics. Some of the biological challenges that eastern fox squirrels encounter include. Number 1. Predation. Eastern fox squirrels have several natural predators, including birds of prey, for example, hawks and owls, snakes, raccoons, domestic cats, and larger mammals like foxes and coyotes. Predation pressure can be a significant factor affecting squirrel populations. Number 2. Disease. Squirrels, like many other wildlife species, are susceptible to various diseases. Common diseases that can affect eastern fox squirrels include squirrel pox virus, which is carried by fleas, and various internal parasites. Disease outbreaks can impact squirrel populations, especially in areas with high squirrel densities. Number 3. Competition. Squirrels may face competition for resources, such as food and nesting sites, from other squirrel species, for example, gray squirrels, as well as other wildlife like birds and chipmunks. Competition can limit access to essential resources. Number 4. Habitat loss and fragmentation. Urbanization, deforestation, and land development can lead to habitat loss and fragmentation, making it challenging for eastern fox squirrels to find suitable areas for nesting, foraging, and dispersal. 
fragmented habitats can also increase the risk of road mortality as squirrels cross roads to access different areas. Number 5. Reproductive Challenges While eastern fox squirrels have adapted to living in urban and suburban environments, they may still face reproductive challenges in heavily developed areas. Increased human activity and disturbances can disrupt nesting and breeding behavior. Number 6. Climate Change Climate change can affect squirrel populations by altering the availability of their food sources and influencing the timing of seasonal events. For example, the emergence of spring vegetation and the availability of nuts and fruits. Changes in temperature and precipitation patterns can also impact squirrel habitat. Number 7. Inbreeding. In small and isolated populations, there is a risk of inbreeding, which can lead to reduced genetic diversity and increased susceptibility to diseases and other environmental stressors. Number 8. Parasites and pathogens. Besides disease, eastern fox squirrels may be affected by parasites such as ticks, mites, and fleas. These parasites can cause discomfort and may carry diseases that can harm the squirrels. Number 9. Human Interactions. While eastern fox squirrels can adapt to urban environments, interactions with humans can present both benefits and challenges. Feeding squirrels or attempting to keep them as pets can disrupt their natural behaviors and lead to potential conflicts with humans.